<laughs> Hi guys, welcome to a new location. Welcome to the first episode of the third season of the Germany Travel Vlog series. Today we are here in the city of Düsseldorf in rainy weather conditions. Düsseldorf is a major city in the North Rhine-Westfalen region, just north of Cologne, an often overlooked city due to its size. It may not have the, the vast area of Cologne or other famous cities, but it has 100 years of history, great art and culture, and plenty of nice German food to enjoy. Düsseldorf combines the charm and tranquility of a German town with all the attractions of a big city, making it a perfect destination for everyone. Before we start our walking tour through the city, let's find a place to shelter and to eat some breakfast. So I'm now doing a 10 minute walk to the Starbucks that's on the most famous street of Dusseldorf, the Koenigsallee. The Königsallee is a top attraction in Düsseldorf. It's known as the most prominent and busiest street in the city and it's also sometimes called the Paris of the Rhine. It's a boulevard of over one kilometer long, full with exclusive shops, surrounded by chestnut trees, crossed by the Kogwaben, where the Düssel River flows. So after my breakfast at the Starbucks I took the tram to uh, the Medienhaven. It's a 15 minutes ride to this and uh, afterwards I will walk back to the center. The Mediahaven is a trendy neighborhood, seamlessly integrated into the Old Port area, where the Rhine River takes a big bend. Here, amidst modern architecture, you will find cozy trusses in the summer, a peaceful marina, interesting facades, and the Rhine Tower. There you have them. And right next to the Rhine Tower, you will find the famous Dancing Gary buildings. Follow the promenade of Düsseldorf, it's right next to the Rhine River. It's a 20 minute walk to the city center.
entrance to the Rhine Tower is 10 euro for an adult. A lift takes you 170 meter higher to a restaurant where you can eat or drink something while enjoying the beautiful views of Düsseldorf and its surrounding area. to the center of the city. So I'm still walking on the promenade next to the Rhine River and I'm going to the Ferris wheel at the Burgplatz. There you have it. So as left for today we are going to visit the city center of course with the Christmas market and the Rathaus but also the longest beer counter in the world. It's in the Bolkerstrabe and the city park, the Hofgarten. of Dusseldorf is a city hall and the prominent landmark of the city. It's located in the heart of the city on the Marktplatz and showcases impressive architectural design. You can visit the Rathaus every Wednesday and Saturday. In Düsseldorf you can find the longest beer counter in the world in the street called the Bolkerstasse. Okay it's not a real beer counter but that's how the more than 250 bars, pubs and historic brewery houses that serves the alt beer in this street is called. During the day and especially in the evening this is the place to be for true beer lovers. So I'm here at the Hope Garden, it's a city park and I think also the most visited one because it's uh, very close to the city center. But of course due to the rainy weather the park is almost empty. so cold it's two degrees it's raining all day long but and I'm soaked but I do this for you guys for the 607 people who are currently subscribed to my channel thank you very much Thank you. 
So here behind me you have the ice skating rink of Düsseldorf. You will find this at the Konis Allee. That was really good. The Christmas market in Düsseldorf is really worth a visit, offering a wide range of traditional German food, drinks and handmade crafts. Normal, it's really busier than this, but it's a Tuesday and the weather is really bad. Now I'm going to drink an old beer at the Volkerstrasse before I do my last stroll around the Christmas market of the Marktplatz. Alle Leute Ich 
So that's it for me here in Düsseldorf. I hope you like this video. If you do, please give me a thumbs up and a reaction in the comment section down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Location, and I'll see you again in another Location. Auf Wiedersehen.